Hello guys, this is James. I am playing games with you to the max. So we're back here with Everland. Now we can jump. And whoa! That's new! And we're back in the sewers and I'm not sure. Whoa! The game changed completely yet again. And it looks really nice, different. As I told you, it explores different gameplay styles, different things. Uh, I'm seriously liking this game. The storyline seems really good as well. And what's this? Okay, I need. Mean, I'm not sure what I need to do to those, but I'm guessing I need the two keys to go to the left. Okay, I can't drown. See what I mean? We started off like Zelda and now it's a platformer. Uh, I'm not sure to what to compare it though. I keep getting money, but I haven't been able to buy anything yet. I'm guessing later on there will be stores. What the? How do I get there? I'm not really sure how to get up there. I'm guessing through the left here. No, it's even more to the right. Oh, I can break them with a regular hit. We're about to level up as well. And I, I, as I told you, the first... Ow! I didn't know the, those were spikes. Sorry. Oh, we're close. Oh. I'm guessing the other thing... I can get it through here. As I was telling you, uh, so far, the, this game's music... Oh yes! I'm so glad I did see it. Third collectible star... Uh, what other was it? Oh yeah, the music. Uh, it's really appropriate and really nice. It's on an 8-bit fashion, but it keeps evolving as well as a game, so I'm guessing the, whenever we get a little bit farther into the game, we're gonna get better or different type of music, uh, rather than the 8-bit style of uh, of music that we have right now. Sorry if I'm exploring everything as I told you on the first episode. I want to get out the most I can out of this game. Explore every inch and corner. Yes! Another collectible. Just to be sure we get the best experience out of it and well I think it's fun to you guys as well because you can see how the full game is oh they can be killed I didn't think they could be killed and I'm getting my ass whipped right now okay Oh hell yeah! Level up. Just a little bit more of attack. I mean, I'm not complaining or anything because that does help a lot. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I think I used too much XD yet. Oh man! Woo! It seems like it's not, but it's kind of hard to maneuver Whew, down here. Come on! Ugh. 
I wanted to say. Because you're not precisely swimming, you're just jumping. <laughs> so it's not that easy to get through everything while still killing stuff. I like it because it's a challenge. It's a nice challenge. Okay. Okay. Going down. And I'm thinking this is the one of the new keys. So. Oh, they, these guys remember me the like, the monsters of Mega Man X, the ones with the big legs that you have to keep back in the eye. Okay. So I'm guessing I'll have to do something similar back here to get the other key. These guys are really giving me a lot of experience. Oh man, but I can't throw myself onto the acid. Whoa, that was a lot of XP. Hell yeah, that's a great level up. I'm not sure if it's random or if it's pre-programmed. Oh, this reminds me so much to Mario Bros. The, uh, one of the Bowser castles that has all the nets just like that. See what I mean? Why I like this game so far? that much and we've got something back there <laughs> hop to hop yeah it remind me way too much uh, games but good what would you say that's alive not really sure because I'm liking it, liking it because it reminds me way too much games I've loved and played throughout my childhood. It's just amazing how they could make a game like that. And it's challenging as well, so... When a game is challenging like that, it's fun to play, fun to uh, think about all the game, it reminds you, and just look at it, it's a really beautiful game so far. Oh man, didn't time that well enough, <laughs> I'm just glad I could get through. Oh, look at all that experience right there. Yeah, monsters here are giving way too much experience. I'm not sure if it's just because they're in challenge mode or really tough challenges are coming soon. Ow! Ow! Whoa! Did you see how much HP did that? Okay, I really need a little bit more of experience. Crap. Oh man! Oh well. I was close by so I won't have it. That section. Oh, I'm glad the experience is saved up. And I think there's something back to the right so it wants to yeah that was on purpose sorry about that but I don't want to miss anything and it's Oricon that I think that's oh sorry about that <laughs> Oricon that I'm supposing or I'm guessing that's a reference 
to Oreg Chalcom. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it well enough, but I think it's a reference to Oreg Chalcom, Oreg Chalcom, Oreg. I'm not sure how it's pronounced. <laughs> Maybe you can tell me on the comments, but I'm pretty sure it's a reference to Oreg Chalcom. I'm gonna call him like that for now. Uh, ow! But anyways, I'm pretty sure it's a reference to that. More green goop. I'm guessing that's weapon material. Or it will be. Watch out of the video if, if available nothing just to be able to have a really nice gaming experience with you guys. And I got both keys. Whoa, that's original. And the old sword has been really mighty so far. I mean, I'm guessing... Oh. So I'm guessing I'll be able to come back later. Open air! That cake smells like tummy rumble, Kuro. Aren't you hungry too? Yep. Let's find an ink. I too would be amendable to a little rest, but we should stay discreet. The city gates are closed due to the war. We shall have a de to devise a plan to get out of this bind. An inn would certainly be a good place to obtain information. My people are more at risk with each hour we waste. That's all said then. We're going to eat. The body needs strength in order to fight. Can't you just say you're hungry, Medus? I... I am hungry. <laughs> ah, there you go. You just have to be honest about your new feelings in life. Immediately it gets easier. We're going to continue this adventure together. We have to be honest with each other. Right, Kuro? Let's go! I'm hungry. Exterminator. Let us gather our strength and find information. Okay, so new town. Let's explore a little bit. Okay, guys, after talking around with the guys at the inn, uh, it seems I found what NPC I had to talk. Uh, either I need food or to pay all my money to be able to go out. So I'm guessing I need to do some exploring in the town to be able to go out. Maybe if this guy... Uh, sells some food uh, or maybe I can make uh, maybe I just need to walk around get talk to people to be able to go through the storyline so I'll just explore that or maybe we'll do that on the next episode for now the sewers, we did all the sewers, and I think it's a good episode. Uh, yeah, it was long enough, so I'm going to leave it there, guys. So thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, click the like button down below until it explodes. Be sure to leave your comments down below and to tell me which games you want me to play. If you have any suggestions, I'll be sure to read them out and to play them for you. So... And next one, guys. See ya. Bye bye. See you later. See you later. See you later. See ya. Okay, I need to do something. Oh, I can pull them around. Okay. I think I might have to use them later on. Oh, man. Um, okay, let's see. We need to get up somewhere. But this is in the way, doesn't seem like a